What was once considered a prominent church in the Pleasant Hill community now burned to the ground. Macon Bibb Fire Department says they're still trying to figure out what caused the fire. Abby Casora spoke to people in the neighborhood who say it is a loss for the entire community. They see a ghetto, but you know, I, I see a paradise. George Muhammad grew up in the Pleasant Hill neighborhood. He passed the Mount Team of Primitive Baptist Church on his way home. He, he can't be replaced. He remembers hearing stories from his mom about how it used to be the neighborhood's church, playing songs on washboards, country style. And she said, my daddy loved the music that they used to play in this church. And you could hear it all over the neighborhood and people would come on a regular basis. You on Sunday night, he followed the smoke he could see from the interstate right here where he saw the church burning. Mohammed said he even recovered this sign from the wreckage. The building itself was built almost a hundred years ago and neighbors say it's been abandoned for more than 10 years. We definitely do not need to be going backwards. Stuff catching on fire, uh, people, people putting it on fire. Uh, we definitely don't need to go backwards. Arion Smith says fires and abandoned structures are preventing the neighborhood from moving forward. I just want to see Pleasant Hill get back, back to where it once was. Muhammad and Smith both say there have been recent efforts to improve the community, but this fire is a step backwards. It represented a, a beautiful asset. It enhances the neighborhood. It wasn't about whether this is my church or not. This is like the neighborhood's church. They say the church, even though it was reduced to a blighted shell, will be missed. In Macon, Abby Casores, 13 WMAZ News. Megan Bibb Fire Investigator Ben Gleaton says the church was destroyed. He also said there was a smaller fire in the church's basement about a year ago.